are exploring a time capsule paint shop. Nobody has been in here for decades. Look what I've just found in the workshop. I wonder how old this is. These have never even been opened. This is one incredible fireplace. The bathroom is completely untouched. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel, welcome to today's video. As you can see, I'm joined with Stu, and today we've come to have a look at a time capsule house which has got some extra bits which are very, very interesting. Let's go and check it out and see what we can find. Okay guys, so we are now here and the first room we walk into is the kitchen. And as you can see, the stuff in here is very, very old. This place has been empty for a very long time. Look at the old quality street tin. If any of you guys can put an age on that, please pop it in the comments below. And you look around at some of the stuff here. I mean, this is dating back at least 30, 40, maybe even 50 years. This is absolutely incredible. Natural decay at its finest. But there's another tin of quality streets there. Look at the old wood stovelet. That is really, really nice. God, I love coming to places like this. Oh, there's not much in there. Okay, let's go and see another room. So we've got a dining room here. Oh my goodness me. This is incredible. Look at the fireplace. I think that's real marble, you know. I think it is. A little picture frame there. Look at the couch. Oh, it's a shame that that's been damaged. But it's all natural decay, so I'm not, I'm not that sad about it really, as long as it's not vandalism. Got the old TV there, and there is a huge picture. I don't know whether this is the guy who used to live here. very difficult to tell and we've got a room here sadly that we're not going to be able to go into because it's um well as you can see completely destroyed sadly the roof has come down the floor has come down from above yeah it's a right mess in there I'm guessing that that was probably upstairs but because of the weight of it it's now downstairs okay let's move into the next room Wow. Oh, we've got a basement, which I don't think we're gonna be going into today, guys. Um, it looks like it's actually flooded. Yeah, it is. Okay, so sadly, we're not gonna be able to go in there. I don't know how strong those stairs are. I might go down a little way, just to show you what's in here. Oh my God, this is scary. Wow, look at all those bottles. Oh, you can see pretty much all of it from here. So that's lucky. Oh, I'll try and get out. <laughs> Don't want to get too dirty in here because it is very, very mucky. Okay, so we're now in the front room. Now this room is very close to a main road outside. You can see the cars going past. But everything is still here. Look at the chair. That is a really, really nice chair. 
There's lots of letters on the floor where the postman's been posting it, but sadly no one's here to collect them out anymore. Okay, let's go and take a look upstairs now and see what we can find up there. Now, I think the staircase is still pretty strong here. I had a look underneath and it didn't look too bad, so hopefully we should be okay up here. So that's the room where the floor has sadly collapsed. Wow, look, there's still loads of stuff on there. God, that was above my head when I was looking through that door. That is literally ready to fall down any second. So through here, we've got the main bathroom. Look at this. Everything is still there. A complete time capsule. Oh my goodness, the bath is actually full up still. Look at that. Oh, dearie me, that is pretty disgusting, actually. Oh. Still got a few bits in the medical cabinet. Oh dear, yeah, that's not very nice in there. Okay, let's move through to one of the bedrooms. Oh, we've got some big holes in the floor there. Okay, we might not be able to go in that one. In fact, no, definitely not. We're not gonna be able to go into that room. But um, you can pretty much see everything that's in there from here. Someone's hung the shirts up on the light shade, which is very nice, I must say. Look at that. Wardrobe's falling through. I don't know whether that's the actual floor that's gone while that's falling over. Potentially it could be. Got some lovely paint peel on the door, look. That is really, really nice. Okay, let's move into, I think this could be the master bedroom. Again, the floor, very, very dangerous in places, so I need to tread carefully. And we've got the main bed there, all the bed sheets still on it, pillows. One of the other lampshades here. Look at that lampshade, guys, that is beautiful. That is so nice. So we've got, a, I think that's a gas heater just there. Another lovely fireplace. Is that marble? Yeah, potentially another marble fireplace. That's a little bit um, strange. I wonder what that was used for. If any of you guys know, please pop it in the comments below. Oh, look at that, I didn't even see this. That's an old sewing machine, isn't it? If any of you guys have got the correct name for that, please pop it in the comments. Goodness me, that is really, really old. That is incredibly old. Can hear um, Stu believe me. Wow, it's so lovely this place. That lampshade is stunning. Okay, let's uh, go and have a look and see what else we can find on this floor. So we've got another bedroom, I think, through here. Oh, again, the floor is very, very dangerous, so I'm gonna have to tread carefully. Look at this guys, everything's still in here. Another marble fireplace in the corner. Huge portrait on the wall, another lampshade. Oh wow, this is so cool. It's so lovely to see this stuff. The little mangers. This is very, very old. Now we have got another staircase which takes us upstairs into the loft space. I'm gonna try. Squeeze past if I can. Oh. oh wow, this is huge. And very, very dangerous. Guys, look at that. That is extremely dangerous. Look at all that weight. If that's plasterboard, which I think it is, you know how heavy plasterboard is. Okay, I don't think we're gonna be able to go up here, sadly. We can see most of it from here. Wow, okay, let's um, head back downstairs and go and check out the other rooms that we haven't seen yet. Okay, so back downstairs, and I just wanted to have a look because I thought I heard Stuart in a room below me when I was in that bedroom. And I think I was right. I think we need to go and have a look over here. Now, I'm being very brave here because this is extremely dangerous. I might have been looking up at the moment. Oh, guys, look at this. Oh, wow. Okay, this is worth the 
a dangerous little walk. Look at this. Look at that fireplace. That is a marble fireplace. That is absolutely beautiful. And look at the photographs. Wow. Have a picture up on the wall there. This furniture is so old. Look at the detail on that. God, look at the mold on the curtains. Goodness me. Wow, this is um, very impressive. Okay guys, so we're gonna make the dangerous walk across the uh, scary room again. Oh my God. And we're gonna go and have a look in a couple more areas which I haven't seen yet. Oh wow, look at that, that's a safe. Guys, look at the size of that safe. Wow, that is really cool. My goodness me, it looks like someone's broken into it at some point. Obviously lost the keys for it. Okay, let's go and have a look outside and see what are in the other buildings. Okay, so we're back out in the courtyard now. This is one of the most incredible parts of this. This was the paint shop. And look at this guys, all of the tins of paint are still here. A complete time capsule. Nobody has been in here for years. Look at all of the colours. I think these are all water-based paints. And all of the tins, look, none of them have been opened. They've just been standing still here for years upon years. Just look at it. It's amazing, it really is. All these unopened boxes. Just been sitting here collecting dust. Wow. I don't actually want to move anything. I just like to look at it as I find it. It's um, it's just unbelievable. It really is. My goodness. Completely untouched. I'm guessing either the guy had um, like a hobby or this was his actual shop that he used to sell the paints from. Have a quick look up here. It is getting quite dark now, so we're gonna have to hurry up a little bit. It's just a storeroom. I don't think there's that much up here, to be honest. There's a water heater right there in the corner. Oh, there's a tractor going past, which is quite noisy. We'll get back down and go see what Stu's looking at. Oh, here's Stu. What have you found in there? Right. What did you find in there? Is that a van? Is that a, is that a camper van? Yep. Oh, guys, look at this. Oh my God, that is so cool. Look at it, completely covered in dust. Oh my goodness me, this is really cool. Look at all the stickers, look, they've obviously done a lot of driving. All the places they've visited in the past and sadly now it's just sat here. Oh, look at that. The door is open, let's have a little look inside. Look at that, 50,541 miles on the clock. And look at the condition of that seat. Oh, this is so lovely. So lovely. I'm gonna shut that back up. That is a beautiful little van. I'll be honest, I don't know the model of it. If any of you guys know what model of van that is, please pop it in the comments below. I'd love to know. Goodness me. I've got another room here full of, well, wow, just doors. Oh, the roof's falling through, actually, it looks quite dangerous. Better not go too far over there. Have a little look house to see what we can find in here. Is there anything over there? No, there's not a lot in there, just a lot of rubble. There's still loads of tools lying around, look. 
It's a really big place, this. Really big. If you look closely, there is actually a lot of old stuff lying around. Toolboxes, tools. A little store room there. There may be something in there. Gotta be careful with my tread, because there's lots of um, broken glass around. Wow, that. Goodness me, that roof is literally ready to fall down. That, that is not going to stay up there for much longer. I'm not going anywhere near that. Oh, get away from that quickly. <laughs> yeah, not going to be able to go out there, sadly. Oh, that's nice. Look at that chair. Oh, that chair is beautiful. Look at that. That's like the one we found inside. But this one isn't damaged. Wow, really, really nice, that. All the stonework there, look. Right, guys, I think we've seen pretty much everything here, so we're gonna run around, do some pictures, do some Instagram stories and TikTok videos, and we'll see you again in a minute. Right, guys, we are all done. Hope you've enjoyed today's video. Please like and subscribe. Please go and check out the Instagram, which is the Beard Explorer underscore. Also go and check out the Facebook page. Like always, we put all the pictures on Facebook. Tell the best of Instagram, and I will link to you in the description below. And we'll see you on next week's video. So lovely. We've just got rumbled by some explorers it'll just run away it's really funny